Uh, were you happy with the release of Security Breach when it first came out? Um, security Breach, uh, there, there's there's a really big story behind that. Um, that that was definitely a challenging period, and a lot of things, a lot of things just didn't align up uh, perfectly for that. And there were a lot of reasons for that. I mean, obviously. It, I, you know, I hear lots of studios and things kind of blame COVID for stuff, but there is a reason for that. You know, COVID took well-structured work systems and suddenly scattered them and expected the work to continue to flow. And it just doesn't work that way. I, if, from my understanding, I'm pretty sure most, if not every, member of Steel Wool got scattered across the country and were trying to just carry on with the workflow. Um, and it, it's, it's just it was just really difficult. I think that that's really the only example when um, my idea of how a game was going to go was misaligned with how things were going with Steel Wool, and I had I had a specific story for this in mind. Okay, for Security Breach, I really did. I had a very specific story in mind, and it is very different than the one that got in the game. And I think a part of that is the way that I conveyed that to Steel Wool. Because what I was trying to do was I was trying to tell Steel Wool to do specific things throughout the game, put specific items in specific places, have specific characters do certain things. Meanwhile, not telling them what the story plot was, because I in my head, I was thinking, OK, when people find this, they will connect this to this to this and it will all be revealed and i thought i could do that without telling steel wool the story plot that didn't work out very well because they got all of these pieces and they thought it was their job to connect them in a way that made sense and so really what you ended up having were the same pieces but telling completely different stories and and since i was trying to kind of tell a specific story with mine that went a certain direction they were taking pieces i didn't fully understand and trying to craft a story out of them and again i don't blame them for that i blame myself for that because i guess what i should have done is just said hey here's the story here's why these pieces are here here's how they're supposed to connect and i'm gonna i can give you a really easy example for this and and i'm, I'm hesitant to say this because i don't like messing with the lore but i think in this case it's okay when it comes to burn traps Originally, Burn Trap was never supposed to move. He was supposed to just be something you saw in the corners, or like if you were walking past the machinery, you might be able to peek in between two things and see him in the corner or propped up against a wall, almost like almost like a, a some kind of decaying movie prop. And you never fully understood what his purpose was. And he had a very specific purpose. And I'm not going to say what that purpose was, but realistically, he never moved well obviously that's not what we got in security breach <laughs> in security breach we got a capsule opening and purple smoke flowing out and him climbing out and coming to get you <laughs> and so it's just not, not quite the same thing so but anyway it, it 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 didn't turn out the way anybody wanted but hey whenever that happens just like whenever uh you know i stepped in it a little bit with fnaf world you know me and steel will got together we were like look all that matters now is making things right by the fan base. That that's all that matters. You know, we we all had the best intentions going on. We all wanted to to make a good product, and we went in and we made uh, ruin for it. And and I and I, I hope that, that uh, redeemed the game. And I, I feel like it did because I think it was really great. And and yeah, and anything that we do going forward that continues uh, that story or has those same themes, um, I, I I think we're just going to be in a much much better situation to to continue on.